On today's episode of Stupid Calls for Service, many years ago I get dispatched to a house for a, a residential burglary already occurred. And it's a pretty average house, pretty average neighborhood. And I pull up, get out, and meet with the complainant, uh, middle aged lady. And uh, the initial, you know, hey, Deputy Porter, Green County Sheriff's Office, blah, blah, blah. Tell me what happened. She says, Well, honey, I had to go to the grocery store to get some groceries, and I was only going to be gone a minute, so I figured I'd just leave the garage door open. Wasn't nobody going to get in. So I come back, and there's a man parked in my driveway in a big old truck, and he's walking out of the garage with my husband's electric saw, you know, the kind that goes in a circle like that. And, and I said, Sir, can I help you? And he said, Well, I'm from the repair shop. And your husband called and said that he wanted me to come pick up this saw and take it and fix it and change the spark plug. And I said, well, okay. And I moved my car and I let him out. And then I called my husband. And my husband said, well, he said all sorts of vile things to me. And then he said that that, that man wasn't from a repair shop and that electric saws don't have spark plugs. So... Not only did this woman, and you know, this happens all the time, but the woman leaves, leaves her garage door open, open thinking, hey, I'm just going to be gone a few minutes. She comes back. There's a man parked in her driveway, exiting her garage with a power tool. She questions him. The guy, and I got to give him credit, thinking on his feet, I'm from the repair shop and I've got to take this saw and get the spark plug changed in it. She says, okay, moves her car so he can get his truck out. He leaves and then she calls her husband, who undoubtedly was upset with her. But uh, yeah, that's just, you know what, that's the first call out of the chute on any given day, in any given town, in any given police department or sheriff's office. So yeah, what's a good way to start your day off? Tell me.